All right, guys, hopefully y'all can see me. It is hot, that sun is bright. We are downtown Knoxville and we were fishing the weeknighter, the ETKA weeknight tournament. Uh, there's about eight or nine of us. It runs from 6 p.m. to 9 p.m. We're down here on the Tennessee River. I'm running upriver. I got about two miles, two and a half miles. So we don't have a lot of time. We got the motor on full blast and we've got the kayak on full blast. Our legs right here. So hopefully we can get a W tonight. Like I said, there's about nine of us. It's probably gonna be tough, but we'll see. We're gonna have a little fun. See if we can catch us a few. But when I tell you all it's hot, I think it was close to 100 degrees today. I mean, it's miserable, humid. You can't breathe. You sweat by standing there and there is no clouds. I was hoping we'd have a little bit of flow. We ain't got no flow, so it's gonna make it a little tougher not having any flow at all, so we'll see. I'm not even sure how many fish we're supposed to... Well, I guess we'll take pictures of all of them. I don't know if it's a three fish or a five fish limit. I didn't ask. I'm gonna guess three since it's, you know, a weeknighter and it's only three hours. I'm gonna guess three fish only. <laughs> uh, the worst part is being able to only go five and a half miles an hour or so. We're in a jet boat or a bass boat. We'll be up to our spot in six minutes. <laughs> where it takes about 30 in the kayak. We're probably gonna lose about at least 40 minutes of fishing running up here. So that's why I'm gonna try to hit a couple little spots on the way up. I've got somebody else going up as well, kind of where I'm going. So I gotta make it quick. That's why I kind of jumped out ahead. The way I could fish a couple spots. I don't have to worry about him beating me up to my spot because I definitely wanna fish it. Another thing I did was switch my 15 pound braid down to 10. I tried to find 12, I couldn't find it. So definitely getting a lot better cast. short. It's gonna be short. It'll be close anyways. 11 inches. 11. But it's time now. So we just passed somebody fishing. Uh, they probably launched right up here. So I'm gonna say that they probably already fished all this. Doesn't really mean anything, but I'm pretty confident someone's is that a smallmouth. Good lord, that was a smallmouth. That looked like a damn smallmouth. Man. Damn, it looked like a small mouth. It could have been a carp, but 
the color of that fish looked like a smallmouth. But what I was saying though, this guy's probably already fished this stuff. I'm pretty confident this has already been fished. But like I said, we can still catch them, 100%. Number one, Smiley, nice one too. Pissed. Thirteen and a half. First keeper, thirteen and a half. smart to run up here after all if we can get one more that is 15 and a half actually let's take one more because I don't know if it touched 15 and a half just then there we go 15 and a half number two thanks body Good. This is what I wanted. This is what I was hoping for. Find some smallmouth up here. I got a feeling though, if we run up there though, and we spend 15, 20 minutes and then run back down, we could catch another keeper up there. And we're pretty close, so we may go ahead and go for it. Unless we can catch one right here. If we can catch one more keeper right here, we may not do it. All right, last cast. I think we're gonna run on up before we run out of time. Let's go. Let's go for it. We've got two. Let's get one more. We're going to have to make some ground up. Paddle hard. we got to get up there. 725. we got to be back at the ramp at 9. we got an hour and, what, barely an hour and a half. Definitely got some flow on this river here on the French. Because my speed has slowed down tremendously, which would be really good right here for these fish. So let me get one more fish right here. It'll be everything. I'm gonna hook it back down. Get one more keeper. Gotta catch one more, man. We gotta catch one more. Come on, come on, come on. Get one more fish. One more keeper. We'll blast off. Got to go. 7.50. We got about an hour and 10 minutes to get back down the river. Oh, oh, oh. We'll wait. We'll wait. And a fish. I think we got a fish, baby. We do. Uh, thank you. Got us a keeper. Number three. Twelve and a half. Come here, bud. There's a limit. Twelve and a half. And get us one more. At least we got a limit. I know that. Pretty sure we got a limit. <laughs> I'm not positive. I don't think it's five. Not with it being a, a three-hour tournament. All right, we're gonna fish to right up here in this corner, and we're gonna just go ahead and book it on back down, guys. If we if we have a little extra time, we'll fish down there. 
but I, we definitely just don't we don't need to be late you never know you know you know don't miss out on money if you've got a chance to win it you never know to in this trail you know a lot of times some of these guys don't catch limits this lake is tough these rivers have been tough what in the hell is that that's a something out here messing on the line some type of fish on the surface i don't know what it was it looked like he shook his head like he was nibbling on my line or something i don't know super weird oh golly be an upgrade no I don't think so I'm gonna hit it as soon as I hit the water though and he's pissed off smallest is 12 that one's 11 not even gonna help us all right guys let's run back uh, we've got an uh, 55 minutes to get back down there I think we can do it I think we can do it. Nothing. What? Do you? How many you got? Huh? Uno? Hey, lose it now. What? I said lose it. Ah, oh, it's a short. It's a short. It's a short. There we go. I got two. Don't be giving me the juice, Josh. Look. Not expect me to use it. Listen. What is it? Kitek? Uh, Berkeley Power Bar, but same thing. They're finally getting some current right here. When I come up here earlier, there was no current. They're, that water's coming down the French. Really? Yeah, there was no flow an hour ago right here. Zero. Zero. Literally, no joke. Zero flow right here an hour ago. Yeah, there, uh, yeah, there was none earlier. Zero. Yeah. Hopefully. At least you have two of them. Well, I'm going to too, because I mean, it ain't like I can run that damn fast. Good thing is the current is flowing now, so it, I was going six miles an hour down through there, which is about an hour mile per hour faster than I'm than I usually go. So, dude. It's a giant, giant. It's a giant, giant. It's not a keeper. Oh, he swallowed it. Shit. Throw that little guy back. He's short. Woo! What's up, boys? River Sports crew. My brakes ain't working, guys. It won't stop. Going first. How was it? I don't know yet. I mean, I've caught three. I've got a limit, but I got to be back down at the ramp by nine, James White. But I ran all the way up there to Three Rivers. Damn. Yeah. But I don't know how, how those guys did, though. So I think it's a three fish limit. I don't even know. I got oh, three, though. Three's the limit? Oh, I shit. think so. I got three. I know he just caught his second. Okay. We'll see how they did. You need a bear? Got one? There you go. <laughs> Empty stomach too. I know. I'll be up here like trying to get out of the ramp. <laughs> <laughs> He's trying to let you yeah. 
I'd hang out with y'all longer, but I got to go. I got a limit. Hopefully, I'll take these boys money tonight. I'll pay for my gas tomorrow. <laughs> See y'all. I need to I need to fill all my schedule so I can work one day next week or something. All right, see you guys. Be safe. Good evening, East Tennessee Kayak Anglers Wednesday Night Derby. We're at James White Parkway Volunteer Landing. There's so many names for this ramp, but it is the ramp underneath James White Parkway. Uh, it was a pretty tough night for everybody. I don't think we didn't get any limits, uh, but we will start with big fish of the night, which is 15 and a half inches. Josh White, congrats. He won a never lost lanyard. That's his uh, prize for today. What'd you catch it on? Buzzbait. Buzzbait. Second place. 27 and three quarters. Chat. You're uh, not a stranger up here, buddy. It is $48. Uh -huh. What'd you catch it on? Uh, underspin and Cinco. Underspin? Underspin. Oh, Living wow. the floating dock. Wow. And I lied. We did have a limit. We did have a limit. I lied. This man tricked me all night. He said, I didn't have a limit. I didn't have a limit. I didn't have a limit. He had a limit. Josh Sharp, 41 and a half. Good for seventy-two dollars. Oh, I'll shake your hand. Thanks, buddy. Take your money. Heck yeah. What you catching on? Take a guess. Probably Kitek. Yep. Nope. Oh, oh. Well, no. Oh, rage. It's like the Kitek. Two point seven five. I think it's what is it? The rage swimmer. The rage little rage swimmer. Yeah. Okay. I quit using the, the Kitek. They break. So I went to like the rage. All right. Swimmer. So to me, paddle tail swim bait. Yes. Okay. There Same. we go. All right, guys. All right. Fun little week nighter. Super long haul tonight, man. We went so far. But I had a feeling it wouldn't take a lot to win it. I mean, this this stretch of river going into Loudon is pretty tough this time of year. And uh, I figured if we could catch a limit, we could do really well. So we caught a limit, all smallmouth, so the run was worth it. We got the W, guys. So we turned 25 bucks into, I don't know what it was, $78, $79. And uh, yeah, you just can't beat that. That'll pay for gas tomorrow. So me, John, and Alex, Mr. Creek Fishing Adventures, and Alex Rudd are heading up to a pretty much very remote little river in the middle of the mountains. And we're gonna do some fishing. We're gonna be in the Shelleys. Uh, hopefully we catch some smallmouth. Hopefully, possibly we catch some muskie. There's muskie in this river. And uh, yeah, be looking out for that video. Hopefully, hopefully we can catch them. If not, you probably ain't gonna see a video, but hopefully we'll find something, guys. So yeah, as always, thanks for watching. Please like, please subscribe. We're gonna get to the house, get this trailer unhooked, get the Shelly loaded up switch out some tackle. It's already 9.30, so we gotta get up super early in the morning, get everything together, guys. So yeah, thanks for watching, and we'll see you guys on the next one. Peace.